Welcome my dear students class 5A and class 5B. I'll explain the mathematical expressions today. But at first look at the table. We have numbers, operations and symbols. Numbers like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. Operations we have only 4 operations in math. Plus, minus, multiplied by and divide. Symbols in a letter or shape. Letters like X, Y, Z. And shapes like rectangle, triangle, square, and any other shape. Now, the kinds of mathematical expressions. We have only two kinds of mathematical expressions. The first is called numerical expressions, contains number, numbers and operations. For example, 3 plus 5 equal 8. The second kind of mathematical expressions, symbolic expressions, it contains numeric numbers, operations, and symbols. For example, triangle plus 5 equals 7, x divided by 2 equals 6. And now we have some words that means plus and we have some words means minus and we have some words means by and we have some words means divide at first plus the words that means plus more than add in all some plus increase and total minus the words that means minus difference take away less than decrease subtract minus Fewer. And the word that means by of times this product. And the word that means divide, divided by shared quotient groups split and pair. And now we have two numbers x and y and we want to write each sentence in mathematical expressions at first we have the number x add 5 so it will be x plus 5 the second subtract 4 so x minus 4 multiply 3 so it will be x multiplied by 3 divide 2 so it will be x divide 2 x divide by 2 now we have the number y. Add 5, it will be y plus 5. Subtract 4, it will be y minus 4. Multiply 3, it will be y multiplied by 3. Divide 2, it will be y divided by 2. Now complete using a suitable symbolic expression. Third, the number Z. The second, two third, the number Z. Half of the number Y. Fifth of the number Y. Two is the number Z. The answer, I write the answer with red. 3 times the number x. It will be 3x. Now 5 times the number x. I write it 5x. Now complete using a suitable symbolic expression. Add 6 to the number x. So it will be x plus 6. B subtract 3 from the number y. It will be y minus 3. Multiply 5 by the number z. It will be 5 by z or 5z. Divide the number m by 3. It will be m divided by 3. S3 to the double of x. The double, double of x means 2x. So it will be 2x plus 3. 
and now subtract 5 from the double of the number y. The double of number y will be 2y. And sub we will subtract 5 from the double of y. So the answer will be 2y minus 5. Number g, add 7 to 3 times of the number z. It will be 3z plus 7. Subtract 3 from the half of the number x. It will be half x minus 3. Add 6 to 1 third of the number z. It will be third z plus 6. 5 more than the number x. It will be 5 plus x. 4 times a number z. It will be 4 by z or will be 4 z. 3 less than the number y. It will be y minus 3. And now complete using a suitable symbolic expression. The first Ahmed has LEX and his father gave him 8 pounds. So now he has X plus 8. The length of a rectangle is 3 cm more than its width. If the length is L, so the width will be L minus 3. The perimeter of a square whose side length is L will be 4 by L. If the sum of two numbers is 10 and one of them X, then the other will be 10 minus X. And thank you for listening, my dear students. I hope to see you near. Thank you for listening.